Hey everyone, it's time to dive into one of the most mysterious and controversial topics out there. The Nazi bell, also known as Die Glocke, and its possible connection to the Kecksburg UFO incident. Now, for those of you not familiar, Die Glocke was a top secret Nazi scientific project during World War II. Some say it was a weapon, others think it was a time machine or even a device for anti-gravity propulsion. But here's where it gets really interesting. There's a theory that this mysterious bell-shaped device didn't just disappear after the war. Instead, it might have traveled through time and crashed in Kecksburg, Pennsylvania in 1965. Let's break it down. On December 9, 1965, a fiery object streaked across the sky and crash-landed in the woods near Kecksburg. Eyewitnesses reported seeing a metallic acorn-shaped object which was quickly covered up and hauled away by the military. Sounds familiar? Here's where Die Glock comes in. Some researchers believe that the Nazi bell had the ability to manipulate time and space. They argue that during an experiment, the device vanished from its testing site in 1945 and reappeared 20 years later in Kecksburg. Same shape, similar mysterious military cover-up. And let's not forget, Kecksburg wasn't just any UFO sighting. The detail that stands out is the strange hieroglyphic-like symbols reported to be seen on the object. This has fueled speculation that the markings could be related to those seen on other alleged Nazi artifacts. But of course, not everyone buys into this theory. Skeptics point out that the Kecksburg object was probably just a Soviet satellite or meteorite. They argue that the Nazi bell is nothing more than a myth, a product of our fascination with secret wartime projects and the unknown. Yet, uh, the parallels between D. Glock and the Kecksburg incident are too intriguing to ignore. Both shrouded in secrecy, both subjects of intense military interest, and both continuing to spark debates decades later. So, did the Nazi bell really time travel and crash in Kecksburg? Or is it just another layer of mystery in our endless quest for the truth? Let me know what you think in the comments. And if you enjoyed this deep dive into one of history's most enigmatic events, make sure to like and subscribe for more mind-bending theories. Until next time, keep questioning, keep exploring, and keep the mystery alive. See you in the next video.